the AJC QE Stakes is next. Uh, this is a 10 furlong group, one for three odds. Not what's the top one is Battleground for David Hooley. Baudouin van Vandenberg run for Leon van Rensburg. Court Minstrel for Graham Clutterbuck. Major Tricks to David Hooley. Oceans of Ages, Darren Thompson. San Jose Brilliance, Vinnie Gerard. Amber Angels, Craig Allen. Bassium, Jim Murray. Dakar Girl, Dan Hughes. Megan Markle, Dan Hughes. Marketeer, Paul Rose. The Drunken Legend, Joshua Sutherland. Green Mantle, Craig Beck with Prickles Burn. David Robertson and Rainbow River. Martin lead so 15 this time then. And again, another big feel for this track, and away they go. And sort themselves out through the first foot. I say it looks like it's going to be Bodwin van Vlanderen who's going to take it up, but now taken on by San Jose Brilliance with Oceans of Ages and the Drunken Legend close up as well. But San Jose Brilliance then looks like it's going to settle down into the lead. The Drunken Legend on its inside, Oceans of Ages on the complete inside on the rail then uh, Bodoin van Vlanderen is after that one wider on the track Bassium wider still is Battleground looking towards the back of the field Megan Markle is just about the back marker but San Jose Brilliance leads by a length and a half to Battleground in second and Oceans of Ages third Bassium is fourth and then Major Tricks to the Drunken Legend after that Amber Angels on the inside is going to need a dream split Bodoin van Vlanderen has just lost his place a little bit Prickles bar alongside that one Dakar Girl in mid division with Green Mantle Marketeer being pushed along already and towards the back it's Rainbow River and Megan Markle who bring up the rear but it's San Jose Brilliance who's in the lead leading by two to Major Tricks to Bassium Battleground virtually three in a line then Prickles Burn and the Drunken Legend Bodwin Van Blanderen is now trying to come round the outside Oceans of Ages is there Amber Angels has got work to do so too as Marketeer Green Mantle's going to need to fly from there so too's Megan Markle and Court Minstrel and Rainbow River as well but it's San Jose Brilliance then in the lead three and a half furlongs to go now Mick Prickles Burn is coming through on the outside to look like a big danger Oceans of Ages Bodwin Van Blanderen is also getting into it as well now the Drunken Legend trying to run on Battleground and Bassium after that major trickster but it's still San Jose Brilliance two and a half to go San Jose Brilliance by two lengths to Bodoin Van Vlanderen in second then Prickles Burn and Oceans of Ages major trickster B Battleground of a Drunken Legend next Bassium has switched to the inside but has got a lot of work to do from there but San Jose Brilliance doesn't look like stopping there's a furlong to go and San Jose Brilliance is still three clear off Prickles Burn in second now Bodoin Van Vlanderen starts to get going Oceans of Ages as well and they suddenly smog the leader again as it did in the previous races but look at his bond with Van Vlander and he stopped riding on it completely and Oceans of Ages has taken it and drama here Bodwin Van Vlander and the jockey completely stopped riding on that with a quarter of a furlong to go surely would have won and he just totally stopped there's a stewards in quarry and I'm not surprised um, but the stewards in quarry should be throwing that jockey out for at least six months goodness me Drama to end the week and Oceans of Aegis is the winner and keeps it with for Darren Thompson, Boudouin Van Vlanderen for Leon Van Rensburg. What on earth was Oshin Murphy doing? Amber, Amber Angels was third for Craig Allen, the drunken legend for Joshua Sutherland was fourth and San Jose Brilliance for Vinnie Gerard was fifth. Incredible finish to that race.